new camera? Yeah, guys, I got a new camera, so my videos will be way better. Yep, that's for you guys. Well, I just got a new phone, the Galaxy S7. The camera on it is supposed to be awesome, so hope that you guys notice the difference and get better content. So for today's topic is why did I get the front wheel drive version? I have people constantly commenting, why, 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 why did you get the front wheel drive version? Why? And I'm gonna tell you why. So as you guys know, this is my first car. And for that reason, I had to have a safe first car. So as you guys know, I live in Michigan very snowy when it's winter and then very hot when it's summer therefore in the snow i needed something besides rear wheel drive so it's either all wheel drive or front wheel drive and i know this car comes in all wheel drive but the prices on it are crazy like it's probably a good 10 grand more for the all wheel drive version and i don't want to pay that just for all wheel drive and i know it's a lot better and it it can do a lot of stuff but for the money i guess the front wheel drive version will have to do and I wasn't even gonna get a sports car, so I was happy enough to get a, a sports car of the sun. Like I was saying, I'm happy enough to have a sports car. So to me, a front wheel drive wasn't that bad. I mean, you can't really drift unless you pull the e-brake, and you can't really do uh, like massive burnouts, once again, unless you pull the e-brake. So, I mean, there is the downsides, but at least I was happy I got a sports car for my first car, and it's decent in the winter. As you guys saw my uh, my snow uh, video with my car, it's not that good in the snow right now because it has extreme summer tires, but with the proper winter tires, this car is actually pretty decent in the snow. And don't think that I don't want the all-wheel drive version or a real a rear-wheel drive car. I do. I, I didn't really want a front-wheel drive car, but it will do for what I want and what I could get. Because I was not allowed to get a rear-wheel drive car. I hope you guys don't really like hate on me for it if you guys know what I had to do. It was either that or a truck or some type of SUV that was four-wheel drive. So please don't be mad at me for the front-wheel drive version. I know what you guys are thinking, only economy cars are basically very cheap cars at front wheel drive, and that's sort of true. I don't know why they made this car front wheel drive, but I really don't, but it's just something I have to deal with, because usually sports cars are real wheel drive or all wheel drive. Even the new Audi TTs are front wheel drive, uh, the smallest engine, and I don't know why, because I don't know why they could just make it only all wheel drive or rear wheel drive, I can't say that finally getting beautiful out good 55 degrees very sunny you guys should stay tuned for monday because that's gonna be my first mod video yes mod video it's not the greatest mod but it's the first mod on this channel more is coming it's just taking a very 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 long time but more is coming a little update i will show a video now but I got a sticker that said objects and me are losing. And I saw this on that dude in blues channel. It was on a GTR and I know this is not a GTR, but I saw it was a little cool thing because usually it says object and mirror are appear closer than they are. So I thought this was just a little cool thing to put on there, cheap. And it's, it's funny, I laugh when I look at it. So that's gonna conclude today's TT Thursday. I hope you guys understand this car more and why I chose a front wheel drive car. Um, if you guys have any comments about it or anything, leave it down below. And be tuned for Monday because my first mod is coming. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short little vlog and I will see you guys later. Peace out.